good in class. Welcome to class in Master School Online class. Just two basic science. Today we learn the resources from living things. Resources are the raw materials or useful tools got got it from living things. Plants and animals are used as food. The skin and hide of animals are used to make shoes, bags, belts, etc. Elephants are hunted down for their tops. These stalks can be used for decorations. Plants also are not only used as food. They can also be used to produce wood, paper, textile, etc. In this model, resources for plants and animals and the importance of these resources to self and society will be discussed. As I said earlier, resources are the raw materials. The raw materials you can get from living things without all core resources, or the use food things you can get from living things without core resources. So we know we can use plants and animals uh, for food, like the NEA can be used for food, um, meat, um, the goat it can be used for food, the cow can be used for food, it can, it can also produce milk, which can also be used for food, the NEA produces egg, which can be used for food. While the skin and the height of the cow here yeah, can be used to produce shoes, bags, belts, etc. Resources from animals. The resources, the materials you can get from animals, the raw materials, the useful things you can get from animals. First, the animals can be used as food. Animals serve as sources of protein when they are killed and the cooked flesh consumed. If you kill a goat, it serves as protein. If you kill, um, if you kill it and the flesh will be consumed, like the flesh is meat. While for the pig, the flesh is pork um, and so on. Examples are chicken, turkey, goat, sheep, fish, etc., which are all eaten as food. The fish, the shrimp, the crayfish, the meat, they are all animals. They serve as food. They can be eaten as food. Other products from animals. Apart from food, we can also get some other products from them. Animals produce other products like egg and milk, or parts of the animals can be used to produce products like you got butter, cheese, etc. Uh, mother products can also be gotten from animals like the hen to produce egg, the goats, you can get milk from it. This milk can be also used to produce yogurt. So these are the other products gotten from animals aside food. You can also get eyes and skins from animals. Eyes are the covering of large animals such as the camel, horse, and elephant. White skins are the outer covering of smaller animals, like goats and sheep. That's the difference between eyes. Eyes are gotten from camel, horses, donkeys, elephant, but skin. Skins are gotten from the goats and sheep. Eyes and skins can be used to make bags, shoes, belts. You can just place um, eyes of the Crocodile can be used to produce shoe. Um, the skin of zebra can be used to produce pillow. They can be used for lots of things. The tox, bones, and horns. The bones of animals are also useful. They can be processed to make plates and ornaments. The tox and horns of animals can be painted and glazed to make good decorations for the home. Look at the one here, the misplacement of what it is got it for the tox of elephant. It is used to produce um, musical instrument. This chair is got it from the antelope's antlers. It is used to produce the chair. The chair is used for, and is used for decoration for homes. Feathers, fours, and woods. They also got it from animals. 
the fours, the feathers, and those are very important for the animal. They can, the feather can be used to produce pillow, the four, they can just have four arts, they used to produce the four arts, the wool, they used to produce the wool jacket, they can a um, piece of food. They are all resources from animals. They can also be used as piece of body for transport purposes. The donkey, the camel, they are mostly used to carry loads of goods from one place to another to they help in transform, um, transportation. Some animals are used as beasts to carry or transport goods on their back, as well as do every work. Animals such as camel, horse, and donkey can transport goods from one area to another. They are used to embark in the early days to transport goods, every goods from one place to another. They can also be used um, presently to transform goods from one place to another. But when this um, vehicle already, um, they are no mostly used, but the places where they don't have local, they use the camel, the horses to transport goods from one place to another. As you speak to the camel is carrying goods, the disorder, so the donkey is carrying goods. Now, let's move on to the sources from plants. Um, first resource we can get from plant, cash crops. These are crops grow mainly to make money. Most of us, most of us will have heard of cash crops before. So are crops grow to make money. A lot of, a lot of them are usually exported. Um, the cocoa is exported out of the country or the country. They can use it to produce the chocolate or cash crop. They save them for money. Examples of cash crops are rubber, cotton, maize, granite, cassava, rice, etc. They are all cash crops. They are sold for money. Food crops. These are crops grown mainly for consumption. Examples are seeds and grains like maize, millet, beans, wheat, etc. And the wheat, the food crop, because they are grown mainly because of consumption. The guinea corn, the millet, the beans, they are grown mainly for consumption. They are food crops. Another resource got it from plant is wheat. These are good sources of vitamin. Examples are banana, oranges, watermelon, purple, cherry, etc. They are all fruits. Um, they are got it from animals. We got pineapple, pineapple, watermelon. They are source, good sources of vitamin. Leafy vegetables. Vegetables are also got it from plants. These are food plants that are grown for their leaves. The leaves are eaten when cooked or raw salad. They provide minerals and vitamins. Examples are lettuce, water leaf, cabbage, etc. Lettuce, they are cooked for food uh, or they can be eaten in um, raw salad. The spinach, the cabbage, the ugu, the all leafy vegetables. Oil products. Some food crops are grown in order to extract oil from them. Examples are coconut, granite, oil palm, melon, cotton, etc. The palm oil is grown to extract the um, palm tree is grown to extract palm oil from it. The coconut um, serve as fruit and the oil is also got to used as cream. The palm oil is used to cook. We have the the granite also, they are all oil products and they are used for cooking. Root and stem tubers, they are also resource got from a plant. These crops are grown for their fleshy underground parts, they are served as food. They provide us with carbohydrates and vitamins. Examples of root tubers are sweet potatoes. Cassava and carrots, which are root tuber. Examples of stem tubers are yam, cocoyam, and Irish potatoes. So, the sweet potato, cassava, and carrots. 
and they are root to bar plant where the yam, cocoyam, and Irish potatoes, they are stem tubers. They are grown for their fleshy underground parts. They are, the harvest is always underground and they provide carbohydrates and vitamins for animals. Resources from plants. We also have root crops. These are crops are for the purpose of making furniture, building houses, building ships, canoes, etc. It can also be used for making paper and new strength. Examples of root crops are roku tree, the teak, obichi, maogani, etc. For the roku tree, the tallest tree. Yeah, it can be used to produce wood. The like wood is got from the roku tree and some other trees. They can also be the leaves can also be used to produce paper and new strength. Ornaments and decorations. So plants that have good bright leaves are planted simply for ornamental purposes. They are planted for decoration. They help to beautify the environment. Examples are the pines and some shrubs that the ornamental plant is used to beautify the environment. Medicinal plants. So plants, leaves, roots, and stems are used as medicine to cure some ailments. Examples are the dogoyaro, moringa tree, aloe vera, lemongrass, bova leaves, etc. They um, serve as herb to cure um, diseases. The moringa tree is a good herb, which is medicinal. The aloe vera, the lemongrasses, they are all herbs. They are medicinal plants. They, are all got from plant are resources from plant. Important of plant and animal resources to serve our society. The Bawa they provide food, they provide nutrients, availability of medicine, and certainly the meat the, from animals, the corn from plants, they all serve as food, they provide nutrients, carbohydrates, vitamins, the uh, availability of medicine the aloe vera, the lemongrass, the moringa tree, they all serve as help the uh, availability of medicine, the cash crops, they serve as source of revenue, the source, they also serve as source of protein, the wool, the fur, the feather, um, the skin, the height, they serve as source of protein, employment opportunities, they provide employment, they reduce the level of unemployment, establishment of industries. They have to establish, for example, the cocoa, they have to establish industry to produce, to create, to process the establishing industry, exportation of cash crops, the cocoa, the rubber, the exported, beauty and construction purposes. The local tree serves as construction and it is a beauty of canoes and ships. Questions. Vegetables are good crops that are rich in dust. It's dust is not a resource for plants. A vegetables, B egg, C series, D potato, E carrot. Part of the folly is not a cash crop. A rubber, B cocoa, C vegetables, D cassava, E cotton. One of this is not an animal resource. A either skin, B cheese, C tops, D grains, E feathers. That is an animal food of used to make bags, belts, and shoes. The third question measure theory of vegetables examples. Give three examples of dairy products. Mention any three cash crops. What is a height? Give two examples of animals that have height. What is a skin? Give two examples of animals with skin. What is the difference between a height and a skin? Give four importance of plants and animal resources to cause and society. Thanks for listening. For more inquiries, go to our website. Thank you.